The main messages are that the world economy is likely to continue to grow and with it the demand for energy. Much of that increase in the demand for energy will come from developing economies, those economies which are going to grow most rapidly over the next 20 years, particularly China and India. We expect energy demand to increase over the next 20 years by, by close to 40% or so. So when you think about trade patterns of energy, the obvious thing you have in your mind is this sort of flow of energy from the East to energy thirsty economies in, in Europe and America. What we expect to see is over, over the next 20 years, those trade flows to start reversing and going increasingly from West to East. So I think we expect to see quite significant shift, and perhaps one way of framing that is, is coal moving to be the slowest growing fossil fuel, and instead gas um, becoming the fastest growing fossil fuel we expect to see. The other significant part, we expect renewables to be growing close to, to, to by around 6.5% or so each year for the next 20 years. A key message coming out of the energy outlook is that the implied path for carbon emissions we think is consistent with the, with the central projection looks higher than what was currently perceived within the scientific community to be consistent with temperatures not rising more than two um, degrees. So the central message is more needs to be done. No single initiative or improvement is likely to be sufficient on its own. You're likely to need uh, to make progress on a whole range of fronts. Mm -hmm.